I believe that uh, for the many patients, uh, silicon hydrogel is a better material uh, and the daily disposable modality is certainly the best modality for contact lens wear. So we're able to offer patients much higher levels of oxygen transmission and hopefully that equates to longer, more comfortable, successful contact lens wear for our patients. Principally, the uh, benefits uh, for handling uh, initially is actually related to that little bit higher modulus compared with some hydrogel contact lenses. Uh, so it's important that patients can easily apply and remove their contact lenses. Being able to offer a lens that is really very easy to apply and remove uh, makes a big difference. Comfort-wise, there's not really a big difference between uh, comfort of hydrogels and silicon hydrogel lenses. Uh, both can be very comfortable lenses when they're worn. There are some people that believe that they may have an allergy to silicon and therefore will not be suitable for silicon hydrogel contact lenses. This really is a myth. The silicon within silicon hydrogel lenses is not leached out of the lens. Patients uh, are not really coming into direct contact with the silicon, so a silicon allergy uh, to silicon hydrogel materials is something that really can't happen clinically. The main differences are the um, uh, oxygen transmissibility of the contact lens. So we actually need to consider the oxygen transmissibility across the entire profile of a lens. The critical levels uh, centrally uh, have been reported to be uh, 20 uh, barras or DK over T units and peripherally it's actually 33 DK over T units and currently uh, the daily disposable hydrogel lenses do not meet these requirements across the entire profile of the lens. Uh, and particularly so when we get into higher powered lenses or different designs of lenses, so lenses to correct astigmatism or multifocal contact lenses. And that's why silicon hydrogel materials um, are the better option.